Hey mom, what's up? Welcome back to The Mom Company, a place where we discuss mom life and everything nice. I'm Danielle and I'm happy that you're here today. And today is a hair video. It's London's hair. It's time for her to get her hair washed and braided all over again. We do this about every two to three weeks. So I have my little notebook here because I don't want to miss anything and I want this intro to go by pretty quick so you can get to the good, you know. So today we used on London's hair new products. We used Just For Me products, the natural hair nutrition line. Um, I just got bored with our products that we use and I want to try something new and I just went to the store and I picked something and this is what I came up with. Um, London's hair, it can be dry at times so my focus is on retaining moisture and keeping that hair hydrated, lustrous and soft. So that's what I went with. Um, to wash her hair, I decided to do a co-wash. My first time ever doing a co-wash. I don't even know if I did it right, but I just got the product in there and I'm, I'm really pleased with the results. I used the Just For Me Natural Hair Nutrition Detangling Creamy Co-wash. It smells like a smoothie and London, of course, thinks it's like candy and I love it. It's with coconut milk, shea butter, vitamin E, and sunflower oil. The claims for this is detangling, um, alleviating dryness, and it does not strip the hair while while cleansing it, and it leaves your hair soft and of course tangle free. Where was I? <laughs> so yes, I really love the, the co-wash. We're gonna keep using that. I think every other time that it's time for me to wash her hair, I will do a co-wash. After washing, um, I conditioned. I did not have a Just For Me conditioning product. I just used my Cream of Nature conditioner that I always use. Um, my store was out of, of conditioning products by Just For Me, so I couldn't get one. So after the wash process, I did use this Natural Hair Milk Leave-In Detangler. Um, this, I was really, 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 really really excited to use this because you know detangling is like my least favorite part of doing london's hair her curls are extremely tight and beautiful so that part just takes me a long time and anything to alleviate that mitigate that i think it would be awesome so i tried this and I, it kind of let me down, I'm not gonna lie. It has coconut milk, shea butter, vitamin E, sunflower oil, and it's supposed to nourish for softness and bounce. It claims to contribute to fast and easy untangling. It helps restore moisture and flexibility and shine. The shine was there because it's like a, a, a watery consistency um, when you spray it. So it did leave a bit of a shine. So it's like a watery consistency, if you can see that. It did leave a nice bit of shine. Smells like a smoothie, smells really good. Um, it did soften her hair. However, I don't know that it did a good job at detangling. I think it, I think it needs more of whatever ingredient helps the detangling. That's what it needs. Um, it took me the same amount of time to detangle her hair. So this, I'm gonna have to try again to see maybe I'm using it wrong, but um, this was the detangler. And the, the good part about this is that you can leave it in and you don't have to wash it out. So that helps too. The last product I used was the Moisture Rich Styling Smoothie. And this helps smooth stretch and soften with coconut milk, shea butter, vitamin E, and sunflower oil. It's also part of the natural hair nutrition line by Just For Me. I like this, it smells amazing it is a white cream consistency and it's not heavy it's not cakey it didn't just sit on her hair it absorbed pretty nicely into her hair and I used it on each individual plait or braid or double strand whatever you want to call them and it it really helped to soften and hold her hair into that double strand pattern and I really like it um, I'm, I'm happy to keep using it and 
I have no complaints about this product and as you'll see it kept a nice luster on her hair I will say all of these products did give her hair a nice luster and today I felt her hair because it's the day after that I'm filming this intro and her hair still feels moisturized which oh I'm so happy I'm so happy about that and um, I'm going to rate these products you know a, a in my book um, Aside from this one, this one might be like a little B minus or something like that, but we're going to work on that. And I'm so happy that I get to ch I got to try these new products. I purchased them on my own and this is a very honest review. It's not sponsored, so take it as you will. And that is all. I hope you guys enjoy um London's hair video and I think that's all I have to say. Leave me a comment of love at the bottom in the comment section. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel if you like this content and you want to see more. And also the little plus, the little plus, hit the bell notification so I can always alert you when a new video is uploaded. My camera is overheating. So love you guys. See you later. Bye bye. All right, we're just starting off. We're getting water onto London's hair just to get it all wet. And then we're gonna go in with our Natural Hair Nutrition Detangling Creamy Co-Wash by Just For Me. And I'm going to use it just like shampoo and get it all over her hair, lather it up. Doesn't really lather up like shampoo, but you can move it around like shampoo just to get her hair as clean as I can. Then I'm going to wash all of the product out. I did this twice and now I'm on to conditioning with our regular conditioner by Cream of Nature. It's a detangling and conditioning conditioner. It smells like candy. Then I'm also going to wash that out. Okay, so I found this cute little turban towel at Walmart for like $5. I figured it would help with the drying. And only thing, it just left these little fuzzies in her hair. Anyways, I'm going in with the leave-in detangler by Just For Me. And I'm spraying that all over the section that I'm going to detangle. I'm also using the Moisture Rich Styling Smoothie on each detangling section as well. So I'm going to use the detangler and the styling smoothie together and then I'm going to detangle. After detangling, I'm going to take each section and kind of just double strand it really quick so that I can get it out of the way so I can move all the way up towards the front of her head. Now if we've reached the point we can start styling. I'm doing double strands for the first time ever on London's hair. I think she has enough length for it now. So I'm just parting carefully and then I'll square off each part. I want them to be like a medium size, not too small, not too big. And I'm just going to separate that into two little sections and then wrap around each other like a double twist or a double strand. I make sections like this 
all the way up until I get to the crown of her head where I part from ear to ear and then I'll start doing like a cornrow double strand or like a cornrow double twist. I don't know what it's called, but I'm not braiding, so I'm only using two strands of hair. Yay, we're done with the braiding part. So now I'm just going in with the oil mixture that I have. It has olive oil, vitamin E oil. It also has a little bit of tea tree oil um, to you know, cut down on the itching on her scalp. It has a whole bunch of other oils in it. And I'm just going through and rubbing that in. I got these little, um, little decorations, hair decorations from the beauty supply. And I'm just gonna put that in. She just loves this. We're not doing beads this time, but we're doing these little hair decorations and she's just so excited about them. So my sister-in-law put me onto this edge tamer. It's the best I've used so far, especially for natural hair. And I'm just going to lightly slay her edges. I'm not an edge slayer, you know, I'm not advanced, but I just want her curly cues and flyaways to lay down for a little bit for pictures. And I'm going to do that for her. And then also after I do edges, I'm going to take a satin scarf and just put it over her head like tie her hair down so that her twist can lay flat while I clean up and then I'll remove it and I'll show you guys the finished product. But anyways, thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye. See? <laughs> Turn around. Put your head down. Ugh, not all the way down like that, honey. All right, that is nice. That is so pretty. Turn to the back. Put your head up. Turn around, look at the kitchen. All right, that is nice. Mommy, can I get a picture?